वेलकम वंस अगेन योर चैनल दैट इज स्टडी पॉइंट बाय शैलेश सर यस माय सेल्फ शैलेश बोल रहा हूं इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू गोइंग टू परफॉर्म सम न्यू एक्सपेरिमेंट्स एंड इन अ न्यू डिफरेंट वे टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू द सोडियम मेटल व्हिच इज अ वेरी एक्साइटमेंट एलिमेंट फॉर ऑल द स्टूडेंट दैट हाउ इट शुड अपीयर हाउ डज इट रिएक्ट विद मॉइस्चर हाउ डज इट रिएक्ट विद वाटर सो एंड सो ऑन इवन वी आल्सो नोटेड दैट सोडियम कैन बी soft metal which can be cut with the help of light but you should only just read these things in the books you are unable to observe these things visually so i am going to today show you these things in visual way that how these things are correct about the sodium metal okay just see i have a small piece of sodium like this everyone just see this is a small piece of sodium which is very highly reactive and uh, today i am going to show you that how we should cut the sodium metal with the help of knife and because it is a soft metal so it can be cut with the help of knife and it should be stored in a glass container or metal glass container so that it not be dripped with moisture and it is stored in a kerosene oil so that it not be dripped with the moisture so i am today going to cut it with the help of spatula just see and how it is cut with the help of spatula since it is a soft metal which can be easily cut with i just see this is easily divided into pieces with the help of this like this this is soft metal and which can be cut with the knife just see the shining surface of the sodium everyone just see look these are the shining surfaces of the sodium metals just see i am going to just show you like this just see how does its shining surface is going to be appeared and how it is cut with the help of knife because it is a soft metal so easily we can cut it it is a very highly reactive metal not even try to touch it with the hand suppose if you touch it with the wet hand then it may burn your hand so it should be used with lot of precautions because it is a highly reactive metal today i am going to show you the reaction of this sodium metal with the acid with water and see how does the reactions occur when it react with water and with the acids so first i am going to show you the reaction of sodium metal with water just like see since sodium have ability to burn when it put inside the water so i am going to just show you that how does it react it is with react with water very vigorously like this just see see this the reactions how does it react rapidly with the water like this see the reactions which are occur inside it i am going to use another piece like this just see how vigorously it react with the water since hydrogen gas evolved due to which sodium metal appear to be burn because burning of hydrogen gas produces a flame and uh, we say that sodium metal starts burning okay just see how does it reacts with water okay just listen the sound which is produced the sodium metal react with the water now another experiment i am going to perform you this is a dilute sulfuric acid and i am going to react this sodium metal with the sulfuric acid now just see what are the reactions which are going to be performed inside this like the see This sodium metal is very reactive, so this reaction is vigorously, and with the evolution of hydrogen gas is going to be performed. Just see, small flames are also produced inside this test tube. This is the very dangerous experiment. Not try to perform it by yourself. That's why I am showing you that how the reactivity of the sodium is very high, and it should be used very carefully to perform any experiment. And I think everyone is going to be understand that how we should handle it with a lot of care. Okay, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel.
for more new exciting experiment that is your study point thank you and god bless you